Hey, it's Basil for Grayson Hobby, and we're going to do a little quick video on our new lights we have. And we're going to take our most famous plane we have. Is, well, one of our most famous planes we have is going to be the uh, Dynam Hawk Sky. And you can see here we have a nice little setup. We have a little blue on the wingtips for night flying, blue on the uh, trailing, the, the fuselage in the, in the rear. And then turn it over. We got some, uh, got some white and green and red uh, so we can tell which way the plane's going. And I'll show you in a sec how to hook this up, but this is great for, for flying at night since right now we're at uh, end of June and it's about 120 degrees heat index, and so no one flies in the daytime. So we all fly in the evening, and when it gets dark, you bring this sucker out and you can have yourself another couple more hours of flying time. All right, I'm not sure how this is going to work here on the camera, but as you can see here, we got our blue plane, blue, blue tips on the top, we got a blue on the bottom, and we got to turn it over. You see exactly where the plane's going. Installs very quickly. All you do is peel off the sticky tape in the back, you stick it on your airplane, and you solder it into your main battery pack. All right, like I was saying, here's a strip. It's about one meter, not actually 90 centimeters, which is about 10 centimeters shy of a meter. After you pull the tape off, that's where the sticky adhesiveness is. Also, after you pull the tape off, you can see your see little scissor lines. That's where you can cut the strips at every two inch increments to be have a custom fit on certain parts of the airplane. Okay, on our Hawk Sky, what we've done, we've actually taken the JST connector for the lights and made a pigtail that goes directly into a char the balancing port of our battery. Now, this does not come with the system. This is something extra, but this is something else you can do with, with, your, with your light set. So basically what you could do, you run your main battery, main motor, off the, off the Dean's connector. Then what you do, you run the lights off the balancing port connector. So you can only use one battery pack. Now, if you wish, you can use a small battery pack. On some airplanes, I prefer a 300, little 300 3S battery. Okay, back to the lights. So we're going to have the strip right here. It's all the way to the end. And then what we do, we get to the end and we solder on a little little leads. Negative and positive is very clearly labeled there. And then we have another color right there on the on the uh, the transition between the wing and wing tip. All right, so how do we get to the top? Well, easy. We find any positive or negative line right there. This one happens to be in the middle. Put a little hole in the wing tip. And we come out through the top of the wing, put a little wire there again, positive and negative, and we have the wing tip. Pretty neat, huh? For the rear, we do the same thing. We come out the little cooling hole, get our positive negative strip all the way to the end, positive negative strip on the tail. We have one going positive negative on the tail. We have one going one way, we have one going the other. Strip it that way, strip it that way. So as you can see, it's very, very, very simple to hook up. The hardest part for me is figure out which color and where to put it.